Assalamu alaikum and hello everyone. My name is Nurul Natasha Fatia binti Kamaludin and my partner name is Siti Juleha binti Mat Jalani. My literature name is Madam Nodiana binti Shuko. Today I would like to present our assignment Unit Tourism Place or Destination that can or become tourist attraction throughout the world. We choose Wetamo Blowum Cave, New Zealand. These are among the examples of Wetamo Glowworm Cave at night and also in the morning that tourists can see when they come to travel to Wetamo Glowworm Cave, New Zealand. Introduction of Wetamo Glowworm Cave, New Zealand Wetamo Glowworm Cave, New Zealand known as one of New Zealand's best natural attraction, take a boat ride through the Glowworm Grotto. Marvel at thousands of magical glowworms and become part of over 130 years of cultural and natural history. Discover a 30 million years old landscape and be amazed by modern nature like show. Arachno Champa Luminosa, known as the glowworm, is only found in New Zealand, making the Wetamo Glowworm Cave an absolute mercy. The Wetamu Cave, the most famous of the cave, is divided into two sections. The upper level, which is dry and started with spectacular rock formation, and the bottom level, which is a network of streams that you discover on a magical boat journey. It's a pretty special place. You can do many activities at Wetamu Glowworm Cave, for example, upsell cave walls, go black water rafting, or just marvel at the cave staring ceiling. It really like nowhere else in the world. Why we choose Wetamo Glowworm Cave? Wetamo Glowworm Cave, one of New Zealand's most popular natural attractions. The main reason we choose Wetamo Glowworm Cave because we want to see the cave walls and ceilings surrounded by the wonderful glowworm lights. Next, Wetamo Glowworm Cave is the cave carrying the same name famous for shiny glowworm but the area around Wetamo is not rich only on cave but also on waterfalls and beautiful forests. Lastly, Wetamo Glowworm Cave famous for the abundance of glowworms, intensive underground river system and standing Salactite and salagmite formation are a trip to another world. The easiest way to see the Wetamo Cave is with a walking or a boat tour. Wetamo Glowworm Cave Potential The Wetamo Glowworm Cave located just outside the main Wetamo Township on the North Island of New Zealand. Is a famous attraction because of a size ever population of glowworm that live in the cave, making it convenient for tourists to visit the cave. Wetamo Glowworm Cave has a new tourist facility access routed in the area. In addition, they have also developed several other facilities, thus giving Wetamo Glowworm a better chance to thrive in the present and the future. Tourist Mastering Areas, 256 Dining, Retail, Seminar and Exhibition Area as well as a cafe and theater for client partnership of storing, holding, local Maori tributes and the New Zealand Department of Conventional are among the amenities. Scenery Preservation Act of 1903 the Act provided for the protection of historic places in addition to preserving scenery and thermal area. However, the distinction between historic, scenic, and iconic should not be overstated. With the Pink Society and Horticulture Stick, we are beginning to promote native land for garden use and it frequently expresses nostalgia for scenery as it had been in 1840 suggests the emergence of an interest in the indigenous character of the country. The identification of game places, event, image, flora and fauna were part of New Zealand National Association with the landscape. 
this was reinforced by the emergence of the Polynesian society in the 1890s, concerned with preserving Maori knowledge and places. The reserve acts 1977, the global cave is located within signing reserve established under the reserve act 1977. The reserve acts 1977 was established to acquire, preserve, and manage areas for their conservation values of public, recreational, and educational value. The Reserve Act has a main function which is to provide for the preservation and management for the benefit and enjoyment of the public. Area processing, some special feature of venue such as recreational use, wildlife, landscape amenity, or signing venue. Design standard first is innovative criss-crossed roof and fantastic facility. The ancient Waitomo cave were formed from the limestone transported by water over thousands of years. The woven timber and ETF great shield canopy spanned both the entrance and access path to the historic Lowen Cave. Next are the geometry of the canopy is described by the surface of a toroid and radiata pine LVL was prefabricated into curve and twist ribs outside. These timber I beams were joined in three sections, overlap in layer then screwed together as they were assembled by on site by the contractor. Third design standard in White Tower Glowen Cave are inflated ETFE. A pillows were tethered over the grid shield structure like a tent flight. The long translucent pillows are structurally efficient in span of 4 to 5 meters and follow the lines of the LLV ribs. The grid shield was designed to span across the existing pathway and provide some shelter in the journey to and from the cave as well as maintain a strong connection to the established native Kahikatea Bash. Broadly worked with New Zealand architecture, most covered price the New Zealand architecture medal, the Waitomo Glowern Cave Visitor Centre is an innovative building that showcases the beautiful surrounding landscape. This structure reflects the local culture and the landscape using sustainable but durable material. This new visitor center replacing the fire destroyed remains of the previous one. Now offer dining for 240 people as well as booking, retail and exhibition amenity arranged along the circulation paths to and from the cave. A structurally innovative laminate vinyl lumber LVL which shell forms a lightweight canopy over the path with the amenity placed in between. The grid structure evokes a Heineke or Eonet and is set out by the curve of the white mold stream that also flows through the cave. Clad with clear ETFE deflated Below, the visitors can enjoy the world of the sky as a counterpoint to the glowworm cave beneath.